Well, hello, my little Terribles. Commander Q here with you, welcoming you to the Quinterables vlog. This one I'm going to do a little bit different because we have, uh, we were on a secret mission. And I'll tell you what it was. The Quinterables went to South America, specifically Ecuador, the cities of Quito and Latacunga, over the last two weeks or so, beginning of November, depending on when you're watching this. And uh, we had gone on a little bit of a personal trip, not for fun and vacation, but to go actually work in a couple of orphanages in the country of Ecuador. So we were there about 10 days and we had a kind of a good time. And the issue was, is that with Ecuadorian law and with children that are under state care such as that, we had uh, certain privacy laws where certain things we couldn't film, we couldn't show you. But I still wanted to bring you a piece of it because we um, had some fun times there and we did get to do some touristy stuff. And I kind of want to show you just uh, what it looks like at the equator. That was one of the highlights of the trip, tourism wise, is that we got to see the center of the earth. And they did those cool experiments with like balancing an egg on a nail and which direction the water spins and all that stuff, which I'm going to show you here in the video. So I hope you enjoy this video. It's just some highlights of um, Quito, Ecuador at the equator. And uh, let's see what it looks like at the center of the earth. You stuck with them? Get up. Never. I'll hey. kick your face if you do that again. Get up. He's such a sweet, kind boy, and he just that, that's loves, the love that he loves taking care of the kids. He just wants the rest of He's just until, so full of love. Until five minutes before we oh, go. Oh, he's such a beautiful <laughs> boy. He's so cute. Uh, <laughs> yeah, he's a little crank, isn't he? It's like Christmas with the cranks in here. Look at the fog. Look at that fog. Every morning we look at the fog. I know, but it's so amazing. I mean, that's fog. When people complain, oh, it's so foggy. That's Wait, fog. how do they do it? Oh, it's so foggy. <laughs> That's fog. Oh, I mean, look at that. You cannot even see the city. Can I even see the volcanoes, which I found that there's like four around us right now. I heard that when we go to Latacunga, Latacunga, we're a lot closer to the volcano. I heard that in Latacunga, we actually stay inside the volcano. <laughs> <laughs> but they said we're still safe. We're still elevated. But look at the goggles. Ian, how you doing so far, man? I feel like I'm going to be... Like a little pee. I can only imagine what's going to come out of your mouth next. Pee. Okay. It's not to be anymore. <sighs> Morning, guys. As you know, every good day starts with... Coffee. Coffee. Let me show these guys. You buy this right off the shelf. They're like new refrigeration. No it's just in a cardboard box. And then we keep it in the fridge because that's just it's how we do good. it. But they're... It's better than regular milk. I think it's more like thick, like cream. I guess it's the cows, I don't know. No. They speak Spanish. Yeah, they have Spanish cows. Which has all, all right, kinds guys. of we're interactive. We're in a taxi it's right now. Like a little tour. And uh, so we're taxiing to the actual we're equator. And as Jen was saying a second ago, there's so apparently two equators. The, there's like a fake one, then there's the actual real one. They tell you like a little there's bit about a monument the history of Ecuador and the culture, culture, but it's very it's But we're going to go check it out like and see what the whole deal is. So, what happens when you're on the right now we're in a taxi. There's traffic everywhere. Our lives are in our hands at the moment. <laughs> so, uh, if there's a follow-up video, we're going to be at the equator. See you then.
the much better place to take the video is the surface. Let me know when you are ready. Ready? 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 Okay, please pay attention to the surface and the movements of these lips. This is the equator line. One, two, three. The movements of the lips. Without a big speed. Straight down. Now we're going to see a real difference in the south. Please follow me to Australia. To the surface, please. One, two, and three. So south hemisphere spins, okay. Now you can see the real difference is clockwise to the right. Now we go to the north, south of Korea. Okay, so this is technically southern hemisphere. We walk over, now it's equator, northern hemisphere. Now here in the northern hemisphere, the water is going to spin. Differently. Now is the north. We're going to see a simulation of hurricanes and tornadoes in The surface, please. Now watch. Now it goes counterclockwise. Now you can see the difference. How much more rise to the left? Wow, how cool. Now, folks, we have batteries, and now I think that you can see better the time in the sundial. If you want to see the time in the sundial, please go ahead. Then we're going to continue with the demonstrations. Here, come on, let's go see the sundial. Follow me. But it's current. Now, folks, we're going to practice the next demonstration is to walk, is to walk on the line. It's the drunk test on the cradle line. <laughs> Follow me, please, this way. <laughs> One foot in front of the other, toe to top, toe to top, your arms up and your eyes closed. This is a drunk test and nobody passes. Please try it. Okay. I technically can't do that in any hemisphere. I have, I have complete confidence in you. Give it a whirl. Mm -hmm. Step one foot in front of the other. Eyes open. Eyes open. I walk. Mm -hmm. <laughs> toe to toe. Touch your foot. Toe to toe, babe. And your eyes closed. Oh, and my eyes closed. Yes. The ideas feel that. Feel the pool. Okay. <laughs> no more I wonder if anybody has vlogged while doing this. Because <laughs> I'm going to fall, right? <laughs> Walking on the line. Oh, sorry. I can't do this sorry. like in any hemisphere. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm going. <laughs> no more beers for you. No. <laughs> Nothing. So here's the thing. So I was just walking officially on the equator. I can't do that in either hemisphere with my eyes closed and head back. Yeah. I get, I get, I get dizzy just looking at this. If you close your eyes, it's hard. So what do you want to do? you are in Russia. Russia? Oh. Wow. Well done. Now you're just showing off. Yeah. Okay. It's important because uh, it's important to be liquid Fresh because the yolk, the yellow part of this egg, go straight down to the base. Uh -huh. Remember, here on the equator line, the Coriolis effect doesn't work. Everything is straight down. The reason balance the egg on the top of a nail here on the equator line is easier. Please, folks, try it, and if you got it, the museum give you a certificate. We're going to give you a certification. Oh, oh nice. That you can oh, the egg here on the equator line. Please try it, and if you got it, the certification is for you. Is there any time limit? Or? <laughs> I don't, we have time, but I don't know if you have patience. Papa, <laughs> Haiti. <laughs> Ah, oh, the wind, come on. <laughs> oh, that wasn't mine. Whoa! Whoa. Oh, come on. Oh. I feel like... Let me try. 
I can't get it. All right, so I couldn't do that. Now we're going to see if uh, these two can. Can you see that? Can you get the egg on top of the nail? Can you see the egg? Can you get the side to stand here? Give me your hands. You do it. Yeah! Can you get it? I think the egg on that side is better. I think the egg on that side is better. That egg is better, isn't it? We can try on the other. We can try the other. Make mom's turn. Step down. Step down. Step down. Hopefully you drop it in there. Don't make sure no one trips over my Ah, we are low. Here we go. 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 <laughs> <laughs> so long. So long. I don't know. I'm gonna try that one because that egg is Yeah, they seem to be getting a lot over there. I'm gonna ask Caesar to come over here and show us. I think Jen was lying to you about separating I think she was too. Yeah, she's probably laughing over there. I think Jen tends to lie a lot. I could be wrong. I don't know. No. <laughs> Right. Now I'm going to present to you a first in equator history. Okay, I'm going to moonwalk on the equator. Hey, look. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Well, you don't want none of that. No, you know. I gotta get this egg thing. Now it's bothering me. Jen's laughing at me. I'm just gonna be in the background. All right, we're trying this one again. Come on, eh? see if you can get it. He's having a hard time seeing it, so it's hard. <laughs> Hope he doesn't break that egg. Oh. Oh Alright, let mom try. Yes, please have a seat around for a few minutes. Uh, now, changing of idea, we are in a traditional and original house in the Highlands. It's original because this house stayed here before to create the museum. 1875 is the year. And the techniques you can see in the walls is original too. Mix this wood with mud, straw, volcanic stones, and in some cases blood and excrements of animals. It's important because it's thermical. Maybe you can feel it now. When outside is hot, here inside is cool. Please go in. Come in. Come in, please. Squeak, they like you. So I'm not gonna eat you guys. Yet. You know, being of South American descent, I think some of these guys might be my ancestors. You want me to teach you what they used to do? Not 100% okay, sure. So these were like really bad Native Americans, bad Indians. And when they would fight in a war, and they would win, they would then cut the person's head off. They were dead. See? Cut them off. Mm -hmm. Remove the skull. Hey, Trinker. Okay.